you may be wondering, James, why? Why are you dressed as a unicorn? And 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 I have to tell you, I've I've embraced I've embraced it. I've embraced the left's ideology. I've seen the light. Hallelujah. I've read and read and read HR5. And I finally lost my mind. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. So now I'm no longer James Lane. No, I identify as a Republicorn. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, a Republicorn. I am a right wing unicorn. That's a Republican and a unicorn, a Republicorn. That's that's how now my hat's falling off. That's good. I lost the unicorn's head. This is wonderful. Listen to me, guys. All right. Well, I try to fix this unicorn head. Joe Biden's ridiculous. He's out of his mind. He's half senile and he's probably pissing himself. All right. He gave this ridiculous speech tonight. This ridiculous speech on the one year anniversary of covid. All right. Given his one year covid lockdown uh, 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 speech. Right. And he just BS his way through it, lied through his teeth. It's the reaction video, folks. That's right. The reaction, the Republicorn reaction video of Joe Biden's garbage. We're going to sit here. We're going to watch it. We're going to go through every piece of crap that flies out of Joe Biden's quivering, senile, drooling, toothless mouth next on the American Revely podcast. <laughs> Oh, God, it's so freaking hot. I'm sweating to death. Jeez. I um, It's starting to get warm up here. Hi, guys, by the way. James Lane here. Episode 91, American Reveille podcast. I'm losing my unicorn head. Um, <clears throat> that could be taken in many different ways. It's really hot. It's getting hot up here. It's not that hot. It's like 60 outside, but that's warm up here for Washington State. There's no AC in this apartment. If I put a fan on, you can't hear me and my recording comes out like crap. So guess what? I'm going to sweat to death wearing this unicorn costume for you. That's right, folks. I now identify as a unicorn. I have to come up with some kind of privileges. Like, what kind of privileges? Like, everybody that that's in a gender identified minority class seems to get privileges while white people are punished for any sort of anything, even a hiccup of anything. So, so what kind of privileges would unicorns get? Let me think about that. Like, would I get, um, I don't know, like, would I get like free magical hay rides? Like, I don't, I don't, that's ridiculous. I don't know what kind of benefits being a unicorn would get. Maybe like, if I go to somebody's house and they happen to have a stable, they'll let me sleep there for the night because, you know, a unicorn's kind of like a horse. You know, just walk, go up to the door or something like that. Free carrots at Whole Foods Market. Amazon sponsors a unicorn initiative. I, I, OK, we're done. I'm just just BSing. All right, guys, listen, this guy's out of his mind. Look at that. I know I'm going to rewind it. Obviously, it's probably not even called rewinding anymore because it's not a VCR, but I'm old. But uh, look at his look at this creepy ass guy. He is so scary. He looks like a skeleton. Like you can see his skeleton because of the Botox in his face. Right. You can see it. It's it's just scary. His whole speech is garbage. He's full of crap. He takes a lot of pot shots, bl uh, blames a lot of people for a lot of things, talks about unit. It, it, You'll see. We're going to watch it together. We're going to react to it together. We're going to have some laughs together. All right. And uh, it's going to be a good time. All right. Halfway through, we'll do a break for an ad. Little thing. Don't worry about it. Go right through it. Check it out. It's good stuff. It's the sponsor of the show, Ancient Life Oil, right? Promo code James, ancientlifeoil.com, A-N-C-I-E-N-T, lifeoil.com. This is pure CBD oil, ladies and gentlemen. Good stuff. Good stuff. Headaches, body aches, anxiety, pain. Yeah? Don't want any side effects? Get some CBD oil, ancientlifeoil.com, promo code James, free shipping and handling. Folks. All right. We're going to get into this. We're going to talk about this. 
All right. We're going to look at Joe Biden. We're going to uh, look at his crazy, crappy face for 30, 40 minutes. And, th and that's the thing. That's why I'm really wearing this unicorn costume. Obviously, if you think by now I'm identifying as a unicorn, you're out of your damn mind. Uh, this thing is so freaking hot. It's now just going to look like I murdered a unicorn and I'm wearing its skin. Yes. Oh, this pelt. It's worth 70,000 Dogecoin mm, to the moon, baby. Listen, guys. All right. <laughs> Th this grim reaper guy this th this guy the 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 lead geist from poltergeist here mr uh dementia joe biden he, he's caused so many issues just in this short period of time and it's all intentional all right it's all intentional it all it can't work without all of these uh, different things in place, right? You can't have Antifa without woke culture infecting our kids because then people wouldn't uh, be easily, more easily impressionable and join Antifa. You can't have, you know, uh, 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 the resistance still going on without a Joe Biden character, more of a corporatist lining his own pockets, right? Antifa didn't go away. BLM didn't go away. They're still fighting the man. Trump's out of office. All right. Stuff's getting crazy, all right? There's extremist groups that have pretty much hijacked the left, all right? And then three quarters of the right is is just basically, they're walking, talking, you know what's, all right? They're walking, talking, I'll say a nice word, cowards, all right? That is a very gentle word to put it. We don't have Republicans that fight for us, not many at least, and that's in the Senate and the Congress. Guys, <laughs> this guy's ridiculous. I don't, this is the hard part of my job, okay? Like, I do this with you guys. We make these videos. We have a good time. We talk. We're fighting through the censorship. But it's just as annoying and irritating and hard for me to stare at this freaking Chinese communist sellouts face it, it, and listen to the bull that comes from his mouth. I mean, I want to throw up just as bad as you do. All right. So understand that, that watching it like this is going to be so much better. That's why I'm, I'm probably looking at naming this. I haven't named it yet as I've recorded this, but it'll be named obviously by the time you're seeing it, but I'm probably naming it something to the effect of, um, of my reaction video to Joe Biden's speech is better than Joe Biden's speech because it's going to be. It really is going to be. You've suffered through my mumbling and rambling so far. So anything's got to be better than me just going on all these wild goose chases, going down rabbit holes, trying to explain myself in circles to you. So <clears throat> with that being said, if you aren't following me on Gab, you're wrong. Go to Gab, gab.com, American underscore Reveille. Spell R E V E I L L E. If you're on Parlor, you're not following me, you're wrong. I'm going to give you the Navy knife hand. You are wrong at the James Lane on Parlor. Facebook censored me to holy hell again. They uncensored me for like a week. And then they went, oh, crap, we forgot about that guy. Because all of a sudden my post started ramping up and getting thousands of hits again out of nowhere. I was like, yes. And then now it's back to two people seeing every post. Two people, six people saw your post that you worked on for 40 minutes. So Facebook, I'm leaving you once again. I'll post once in a while. We'll see what happens, guys. But I'm sorry for my Facebook fans. Try to get me on Gab and Parlor. I just told you, Gab American underscore Reveille, Parlor at the James Lane. It's in the description section below. All right. If you're listening on Apple Podcasts, give me that five star rating, baby, and share, share, share. Wherever you're watching this, subscribe, follow, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment. I don't even care if you leave the comment one or the comment poo or the comment Republicorn. Hashtag Republicorn right here, baby. I think that's how a Republicorn would do it. It's not a normal horse. You got to add like a that signifies the unicorn rainbow coming out of my horn. Anyway, listen, I'm done. I've ranted. I've rambled. All right. I'm tired. I worked my butt off. I've been up since 3 a.m. I'm recording this right now, right around, what time is it? My friends, what time is it? 
come on computer it's like 7 10 p.m so you know i've been up all day no break got the kid did school work worked my butt off at work work commute in the traffic here i am quickly ate for like 30 seconds and now we are going to stare at joe biden's disgusting putrid face we're going to stare at his face for like 30 minutes and we're going to talk so much crap about him and it's going to be so worth it it's going to be so worth it for you and also if, if i sound kind of downtrodden it's just because joe biden is like a natural depressing agent to me like the longer i look at him the sadder i get the more i'm like oh god oh god oh man Oh, for those listening, I'm just looking at Joe Biden's face. Ah, like that's literally like the feeling that I feel when I see him. So the compounding effect just makes it super depressing. And, um, you know, I, I just, I just don't want to be alone after I watch. Okay. No, I'm just kidding. All right. Listen, without further ado, I'm rewinding this thing to the beginning here. We'll try to avoid commercials. We're watching this thing on YouTube. Oh God. Oh Oh, oh, I thought I saw a ghost. It's actually Joe Biden in the background. For those listening, you see the long hallway behind the presidential podium, all the different flags on the sides with the Marines and uh, Biden's in the back and he just kind of looks like the crypt keeper. So we're going to start this. Oh, this unicorn's going to make a nice pillow. I'm still wearing the unicorn costume for those listening. Biden's walking so slow. Oh, my God. Good evening, my fellow Americans. Ugh. Tonight, I'd like to talk to you about where we are as we mark one year since everything stopped because of this pandemic. A year ago, we were hit with the virus that was met with silence what? and spread unchecked. Denials for days, weeks, is, then months. What is he talking about? Trump immediately closed our, but look, he doesn't even know where he is. Look at his eyes. He's like, eh. Trump closed our borders. He was calling Trump xenophobic. He was calling Donald Trump racist for closing our borders and doing something immediately. You remember what they all had to say. You remember what Nancy Pelosi had to say. You remember... She was showing us her ice cream and saying, come to Chinatown, San Francisco. It's open. They're so racist. Come. Don't step on the human poop. Listen, guys, he is a lying sack of old poop. Let's keep watching. That led to more deaths, more infections, more stress and more loneliness. Photos and videos from 2019 feel like they were taken in another era. The last vacation, the last birthday with friends. Who wrote this? The last holiday with extended family. Oh my gosh. While it was different for everyone, we all lost something. A collective suffering. I lost my patience with the sacrifice. left. A year filled with the loss of life and the loss of living for all of us. But in the loss, we saw how much there was to gain in appreciation. Yeah, you saw how much there was to gain. Finding light in the darkness is a very American thing to do. In fact, it may be the most American thing we do. And that's what we've done. We've seen frontline and essential workers risking their lives, sometimes losing them, to save and help others. Researchers and scientists racing for a vaccine. Thanks to Trump. So many of you, as Hemingway wrote, oh, being strong you, oh, in all the broken places. Son of a bitch. I know it's been hard. I truly know. Yeah, because you're losing your mind. I told you before. And that's hard. I carry a card in my pocket. Oh, geez. With the number of Americans who oh, died what's that card from say? COVID to date. It's on the back of my schedule. Take your pills. As of now, <laughs> total deaths in America. <laughs> I'm not laughing at the deaths. 000, I'm sorry for everybody that died, but come on, Joe. That's more deaths than in World War I, World War II, the Vietnam War, 
and 9-11 combined. What's the heart disease there death husbands, toll every year? Wives, sons and daughters, grandparents, friends, neighbors, young and old. They leave behind loved ones, unable to truly grieve or to heal, even to have a funeral. What was on his wrist? But I'm also thinking I thought I just saw something on his wrist. Lost this past year to natural causes, by cruel fate of accident or other disease. They too died alone. They too leave behind. He's pulling on your heartstrings to get you hooked in emotionally badly. first. It's a psychological tactic. You know, you've often heard me say before, I talk about the longest walk any parent. Any make. walk for you is the longest walk. a short flight of stairs to his child's bedroom to say, I'm sorry, but I lost my job. Can't oh be here God. anymore. Like my Do dad you hear told him? me, he's low in my I lost voice. Job in Scranton. I lost my job in Scranton. So he's trying to relate to, to common people, but year. we've seen behind the veil. It's not going to happen. Your job. You closed your business, facing eviction, homelessness, hunger, a loss of control. Yeah, and we want to go back Maybe to work. Of all, a loss of hope. Because Watching of you. A generation of children who may be set back up to a year or more. While they're learning about wokeness in affinity groups and how to hate each other. It's the details of life that matter most. And we miss those details. You miss those details the all the time. The small moments. Every moment's Weddings, a small moment for you. Birthdays, graduations, all the things that needed to happen, but didn't. The first date, the family reunions, the Sunday night rituals. It's Which all... Is exactly your Sunday night ritual burning an effigy of a child so while worshiping the owl god Moloch? For we are fundamentally a people. Some of you know what I'm talking about. want to be with others, to talk, to laugh, to hug. Look, he needed a break Hold from on standing on. up straight, so he's now leaning on the podium. This virus has kept us apart. He's getting closer to it. Grandparents haven't seen their children or grandchildren. Parents haven't seen their kids. He got some states kids with some effed up friends. policies. The things we used to do that always filled us with joy have become things we couldn't do and broke our hearts. Somebody wrote this. Too for often him. we've There's turned no against one another. A mask. The easiest thing to do to save lives. What Sometimes are you talking about? Us. States. I want you to know that I heard Ron Paul today, Senator Ron Paul. On Stephen Crowder's show, Louder with Crowder, literally directly say, yeah, masks that probably don't do anything at all, at all. He was talking about Dr. Fauci, and he was saying when Dr. Fauci uh, was lying to people, he was talking about him lying about N95 masks because he didn't want the public to take all the N95 masks and leave a shortage in hospitals because N95s were the only ones that might do something. But those masks that we're all wearing, there's no science behind it. It's so minimal. I mean, it really is. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm not lying. We can fact check it and look it up at any time. You want those facts, you email me, James Lane at AmericanRevely.com. So he's full of crap there. He's lying. Mass does crap. Mass does nothing. Look at Florida. Put it against one another. Instead of working with each other, vicious hate crimes against Asian Americans who've been attacked, harassed, By leftists. Blamed, and scapegoated. At this very moment, so many of them, our fellow Americans, they're on the front lines of this pandemic trying to save lives. And still, still, they're forced to live in fear. He's been practicing this speech just for walking like six down days. In America. Every day he's been it's practicing It's wrong, this. it's un-American, and it must stop. Yeah, of course. Nobody should attack anybody, Look, especially Asian Americans. We know what we need to do to beat this virus. Yeah, because Trump truth. wrote the blueprint. Follow the scientists. The Follow scientists. the Trump Work scientists. Together. Put trust and faith in our government Put to fulfill its most Trump. important function, which is protecting the American people. No Which Trump more did, important. you're welcome. We need to remember the government isn't some foreign force in a distant capital. No, it's us. What All the hell us. are you talking we about? We the people. For no, you it's I, not. Not you. That America thrives. You want big we government, hearts, buddy. When we turn our hands to common purpose. What? And right now, my friends, we're doing just that. 
How are we going to turn our hands to common purpose when a big chunk of this country is absolutely brainwashed into thinking Antifa and BLM didn't even riot for him a year? I a small business owner, a woman. Oh, my God. I asked her, I said, what do you need most? I got to hold my hands like this so they don't see the shaking. She said, looking me in the eye, eye, she said, I just want the truth. The truth. Yeah. Just tell me the truth. Trump's been giving you the truth. Think of that. My fellow Americans, you're owed nothing less than the truth. Yeah. And for all of you asking when things will get back to normal, here is the truth. The only way to get our lives back, to get our economy back. He couldn't back, give us a sentence. Is to beat the virus. You've been hearing me say that for while I was running and the last 50 days I've been president. Yeah, because you can't actually beat it. This is you have to overcome it. This is one of the most complex it. operations we've under, 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 ever undertaken as a nation in a long that Trump time. Trump put together the plan for. That's why I'm using every power I have as president of the United States I'm to put that. us on a war footing to get the job done. Sounds oh, like you want to put us on a war footing, it, all right? Footing. Ask Syria. And thank God we're making some real progress now. In Syria? In my first full day in office, you I signed 9,472 executive to beat orders. This pandemic. We've spent every day since attempting to carry it out. Two months ago, the country, this country, didn't have nearly enough vaccine supply to vaccinate all or ever near all of the American public. But soon we will. We've been working with vaccine manufacturers, Pfizer, Moderna, Johnson and Johnson. You mean those contracts that Trump negotiated? Millions of doses of these three safe, effective vaccines. Hmm. And now, at the direction and with the assistance of my administration, Johnson and Johnson is working together with a competitor, Merck, to speed up and increase the capacity to manufacture new Johnson & Johnson vaccine, which is one shot. In fact, just yesterday, I announced, and I All met of with these the CEOs were originally of both initiated companies, by I announced Trump. our plan to buy an additional 100 million doses. Yeah, because a bunch of vaccine. doses got screwed up because people these weren't distributing them properly. have come together for the good of the nation, and they should look be at Detroit. applauded for it. It's truly a national effort, just like we saw during World War II. Oh, come on. Now, because all the work we've done, we'll have enough vaccine supply for all adults in America by the end of May. That's months ahead of schedule. Yeah. Trump started producing them before they were approved. To put the vaccine in one's arm. <laughs> the Calling vaccinators. Duty military, FEMA. Retired doctors and nurses, administrators. Trump had that all set up already with the, the military. Shots. And we've been creating more places to get the shots. We've made it <laughs> all possible based on Trump's for plans. you to get a vaccine in nearly one, any one of 10,000 pharmacies across Is the country. Is he pissing you off yet? Oh, my Just God. Just like you get your flu shot. We're also working with governors and mayors in red states and blue states to set up and support nearly 600 federally supported vaccination centers that administers yeah. hundreds of thousands because that was going to happen anyway per day uh-huh you can drive up to a stadium or a large parking lot get your shot never leave your car and drive home in less than an hour trump said that We've i swear to god to trump had to have said that like last year all across the exact America, same words located in underserved areas this guy's known to, pro to plagiarize his entire We've speeches been you know that. and we will deploy more mobile vehicles and pop-up clinics to meet you where you <sighs> live so those who are least able to get the vaccine are able to get it great we continue to work on making at-home testing available and we've been focused on serving people in the hardest hit communities of this pandemic black Latino, Native American, and rural communities. Oh, you mean the community is your party so screwed? To. Gotcha. When I took office 50 days ago, A -okay. only 8% of the Americans after months, only 8% of those over the age of 65 had gotten their first vaccination. Today, that number is 65%. Just 14% of Americans over the age of 75, 50, 50 days ago, had gotten their first shot.
this guy is running completely running the plan that Trump was implementing anyway. Guys, by the way, that AOK that I just did, that was the old school way of saying this guy's full of crap. Everybody from my age group knows that and knows what the hell I mean. I can't believe I've got to say it, but in 2021, I have to say that about that symbol. All right. The symbol that we played the freaking, oh, you saw it game in the military and you had to punch somebody or a OK. All right. Does has nothing to do with any racial stuff, nothing to do with any sort of 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 white thing like that. I just did it completely in an innocent manner. And I'm saying that out loud. So for the people who slander me, which there will be, there's also evidence that I have no intention of meaning it in the way that they're going to present it. All right, let's continue. Today, that number all is that I have well to say, it's over 70 percent. crap that I have to do that. With new guidance from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the CDC, that came out on Monday, it means simply this. Millions and millions of grandparents who went months without being able to hug their grandkids yeah. can now do so. Your governors more did that to them. more people are fully vaccinated, the CD will continue to provide additional guidance on what you can do in the workplace, places of worship with your friends, as well as travel. What was he doing with his when hands I came there? into office, you may recall. I bet it says in his teleprompter, move your hands you like this. That kind of way over the top. I said I intended to get 100 million shots in people's arms in my first 100 days in office. Tonight, I can say we're not only going to meet that goal, we're going to beat that goal. Because Trump because had already set that up for you. Goal of 100 million shots he already in knew he was going to hit it office. before he became the president. No other country in the world has done this. None. Trump says you're welcome. Next steps for it's fantastic, about. isn't it? First, it's the best. Tonight, it's the best, it's the best I'm announcing vaccine that ever. I will direct all states, tribes, and territories oh, to make all adults, people 18 and over, eligible to be vaccinated no later than May 1. Okay. Let me say that again. All adult Americans will I really be don't have anything against the vaccine. No all right. I'm skeptical a little bit, just like other people, but I've had That's plenty of injections in my life. I was in the military. Well, let me Any veterans clear. who are in that the military know everyone's gonna have what I'm talking about. I've had a million but shots. You'll be able to get in line beginning so, May 1. Whatever. Every adult will be eligible to get their shot. And to do this, we're going to go from a million shots a day that I promised in December, before I was sworn in, to before maintaining beating our current pace of 2 million shots a day, outpacing the rest of the world. Do you think he has like a little clock in his earpiece that's like tick, 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 that's counting down like to the critical time he has left where his dementia drugs are going to wear off and he's going to be like, we have the critical stuff to take care of what we need in Beijing. You know what I mean? Like, like he's like, beep, 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 beep. Shit, I got to end this speech. I got to get the fuck out of here. You know what I mean? Like, that's what I feel. I feel like he's going to count down to melting. And so he's on a countdown to just melting into a puddle. Alex Mack style. You know what I'm talking about. Nickelodeon 1990s. Secondly, at the time when every adult is eligible in May, we will launch with our partners new tools to make it easier for you to find the vaccine and where to get the shot, including a new website that will help you first find the place to get vaccinated and the one nearest you. No more searching it's day and night to do. for an appointment for you and your loved ones. Thirdly, it's for all the terrified people with the passage of the American Rescue Plan. And I thank oh, again the God. House and Senate for passing it. The thing that and has 9% month, to the American the people. To vaccinate teachers and school staff. The people who don't want to go back to work. Drivers. We can accelerate. Oakley, California. Whole school board just resigned. Look it up. Schools safely. And meet my goal that I stated at the same time about 100 million shots of opening a majority of K through 8 schools in my first 100 days in office. This is going to be the number one priority. Of my when new all the Secretary red states defy him and open their schools, he's going to then take Cardona. credit for it. That's going to be the big Fourth. M. Night Shyamalan twist the at weeks, the end of this. We will issue further guidance 
on what you can and cannot do once fully vaccinated to lessen you the confusion, right. to keep people safe and encourage more people to get vaccinated. And finally, fifth, and maybe most importantly, I promise I will do everything in my power. I will not relent until we beat this virus. But I need you. The American need to people, rest. I need you. Oh, I need God. every American to I don't, do their part. No, you don't need me. I don't need That's you. That's not hyperbole. I need no, you. No, 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 no. no I need no. you to get you can't vaccinated have me. when I'm it's not your available. turn and when you can find I an opportunity. I love you, Joe. <laughs> and to help your family, your friends, your neighbors get vaccinated as well. Because here's the point. The point? If we do all this, if we do our part, if we do this together, by July the 4th, there's a good chance you, your families and friends, will be able to get together in your backyard or in your neighborhood and have a cookout or a barbecue and celebrate Independence Day. That doesn't mean large events with lots of people but, together, but it does mean small groups will be oh, able to on. get together. After this long, hard year, that will make this Independence Day this whole thing is full of crap. I went to a restaurant the other day with my wife, finally. And, and look, I don't go all the time. I'm not spoiled. It was our anniversary, okay? I'd take my wife somewhere, okay? I took my wife out to this restaurant. It was a Brazilian steakhouse, okay? I had my mask under my nose because the place it was in had me put the mask on. And when I came in, the girl comes up and goes, so you got to put your mask on. So I go, oh, crap, fine. Put it on. Look, I don't want to. It's our anniversary, right? I got to be good boy at some point. We go to the table. It's funny, not everybody's six feet apart. Nobody has masks on at the table. You have to put a mask on to go to the bathroom. But other than that, it's a COVID factory if somebody has COVID, right? According to their logic, at least. So, so I mean, really, what's in it? What is it? It's all garbage. It's all BS. Why does he need more time? Why does he need more time? Hmm? All right. People are getting vaccinated. Spikes are going down. Right. And in the red states, people are respecting each other. So what is up his sleeve? What is he conniving? What is actually happening? Something truly special. You're special. Where we not Jim. only mark our independence as a nation, but we begin to mark our independence from this virus. You're trying to topple to the there, nation. We can't let our guard down. This fight is far from order, from yeah. over, as I told the woman in Pennsylvania. I'll tell you the truth. Some random woman. On July 4th with your loved ones is the goal. But a goal, a lot can happen. Conditions can change. The scientists have made clear. I'm making you a promise, but again. I'm also the telling you it's quite possible spread. I will break a promise. We've got work to do to ensure that everyone Which means I'm already lying to you. The safety and effectiveness of all three vaccines. The safety My and effect is, is this. Listen to Dr. Fauci, one of the most distinguished and trusted voices in the oh, world. Oh, come on, Dr. Fauci. He assured us the vaccines are safe. <sighs> they underwent rigorous. I'm not too worried review. about the vaccines, guys. I know, I, I know I'm not, but Fauci. Vice President Harris, Harris and I know this. Harness. Harness. That's why we got the vaccine publicly in front of cameras. You know, we were so done using it see, as a political so weapon. See us do it. And we went, oh, crap, it does work. We need to help people. First lady Shoot, and what the do second do? gentleman also got vaccinated. Talk to your family, friends, your neighbors, the people you this know best who have gotten the vaccine. We need, we need to fund our to coffers. We need everyone to keep washing their hands, stay what socially is, distanced. Is this washing? And keep. Do you see? He went, washing your hands. It's like he's like, if, if you have children in the room, cover their ears. It's like he's grabbing nipples and twisting them. He's like, wash your hands. What is that? What is he doing with his thumb and his finger there? Somebody tell me. Put in the comment section. Wearing the mask as recommended. That looks like a yarmulke. Did you raid Ben Shapiro's Florida home, you had. son of a bitch? Oh, Meeting that's his mask. Virus. Never mind. Getting back to normal depends on Come on. national I bet. unity. And national unity isn't just how politics and politicians vote in Washington. What the loudest voice is This is fun. I think this is how I'm going to do online. all of his speeches. Unity is what we do together as fellow unity. Americans. Because if we don't stay vigilant and the conditions change, 
then we may have to reinstate restrictions to get back on track. Yep, there it is. If you don't do it, I say, then I may. That's I was going for German, and it's just not coming out like that. Hold on. <clears throat> And if you don't do it, I say, then we might have to turn on the showers. Yeah, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. He's saying, do what I tell you. And that's what I was saying earlier. What are they up to? Why do they need more time? What are they planning? Do what I tell you to do. Do what I tell you to do. Or else we might have to shut down the country once again. How would he do that? Would it be a, a, another virus? Would it be a strain? Would he take emergency powers out? How would he get that? Do you think it's even possible? Let me know in the comments. Please, Stop. we don't want to do that again. We've yes, made you do. so much progress. Yeah, you have, this right? Is not Stealing the time our to let government. Up. Just as we were emerging from a dark winter oh, yeah. into a hopeful spring and Game summer, of Thrones it's not the fan time boy. to not stick with the rules. The rules. Close not recommendations. This. We've lost so much over the last year. We've lost family. And f I'll close with this. Do me a favor, guys. All right. I, I, I literally need to go to my balcony and look at the moon and go, ah. So stick around for a second. Watch this quick two minute advertisement for Ancient Life Oil, ancientlifeoil.com, promo code James for free shipping and handling. This is top notch made in the USA CBD oil. Check this out. Let, let me get your attention for a second. I want to tell you about something. I want to share something with you that's very near and dear to me. All right, guys, I have joint pain. I'm sure it's no secret by now. All right. I have joint pain, hip pain. I have elbow pain. I have inflammation. All right. I get stressed out. I'm going through so much political news doing this podcast so much you can imagine how stressful that is all right how much anxiety that can cause how many sleepless nights i have but folks i've been taking cbd oil for a while now all right for a while now and it's fantastic and a while ago just a little while ago i came across ancient life oil all right and i got it from ancientlifeoil.com and this stuff is fantastic all right it's the best source the best and most trusted source for cbd oil in the united states it's 100 percent pure it's 100 percent thc free no psychoactive of a, a effects, no high, nothing like that, just pure CBD, pure relief from all of those issues, relief from sleeplessness, relief from anxiety, relief from stress, from, uh, 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 from inflammation, right? Uh, relief from joint pain, relief from all of these things that could really hinder your daily life, your daily activities, it really put you in a bad place. This stuff lifts your mood up. It's fantastic, all right? It's legal in all 50 states. People are, are, are really experiencing wonderful change in their life, basically doing something that people have been doing for thousands of years, guys. If you head to ancientlifeoil.com, ancientlifeoil.com, the same place I went, all right, the same place I went to get the stuff, you can go on there, use promo code James, J-A-M-E-S, at ancientlifeoil.com, A-N-C-I-E-N-T, -E -E life oil, A-N-C-I-E-N-T, lifeoil.com promo code james j-a-m-e-s promo code james free shipping and delivery folks free shipping and delivery guys this is a great product you are missing out if you need to do cbd and you're just not doing it for some reason guys i don't know what's stopping you anymore it's 2021 folks if you want relief from these issues you want to do it in a natural way without taking medications you want to do it in a way that's helpful i have found cbd oil to be very beneficial and i believe it will be very beneficial for you as well so one more time ancientlifeoil.com a-n-c-i-e-n-t lifeoil.com promo code james promo code james free shipping and delivery folks give it a shot i really really know it'll make you a believer just like I am. All right, folks, let's get back to the show.
Welcome back, guys, folks. If you have a small company or a medium company, if you would like to sponsor the American Reveille podcast, it is a great opportunity for your business and mine. And uh, I would love to hear from you. All right. We're veteran owned and operated. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Who, yeah, send me an email, James Lane at AmericanReveille.com for sponsorship opportunities. Right. Uh, that was Ancient Life Oil good stuff i use it i actually have it right here look boom it's right here on my desk because i use the stuff boom it's good stuff takes away the anxiety takes away the stress takes away a lot of the joint pain inflammation a lot of good stuff comes out of it no side effects nothing crazy ancientlifeoil.com promo code james lane let's get back into this all right guys i've taken too much of your time already all right we got some more talking to look at his face there was a little tooth sticking out he, he, he his mouth literally looks like a sphincter it does he looks like a sphincter he he literally looks like like the corporate bad guy in an 80s flick he really does let's Friends. watch we've lost businesses and dreams we spent years building we've lost time time with each other oh you're Our losing time all right so much time with their friends time with their schools no graduation ceremonies this this spring no graduations from college high school moving up ceremonies you know and there's something else we lost we what, lost your faith mind in whether our government and our democracy can deliver on really hard things yeah for american people you still haven't you're making I it worse here tonight look at the border we're proving once again something i've said time proving and time again you're in probably tired of hearing me say it Tired. I say it to foreign leaders and domestic alike. It's never, ever a good bet to bet against the American people. That is directly him pulling some psychological crap, all right, on Trump and on people. He's trying to manipulate people with that statement. Trump said, he said, don't you ever bet against me. And by him saying, don't you ever bet against the American people, he's right there psychologically and subconsciously and a lot of weak minded people separating the American people on one side, putting Trump on the other and trying to pit them against each other. It is a nasty, dirty, dark manipulation tactic. And that's what he's doing. That's why he also got stronger in his voice. He's all nice and peaceful. The host was, I will do this and you will feel good about it. And I'm a frail old man, so nobody's worried. And then all of a sudden he's like, you never bet against the American people. People, 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 people. He's, you, you see where I'm coming from, guys? He's enunciating it. There's a point to that. There's a point to that. This whole speech is psychological. If he gives you Raisin Bran for the next year, there's a good percentage of folks that are going to forget about all this nonsense and go back to not giving a crap while the Marxists take over our country. Don't let him play you for a fool, ladies and gentlemen. Let's keep going. America is coming back. The development, manufacture, and distribution of vaccines in record time is a true miracle of science. It's a true miracle of it's Donald J. Trump. achievements any country has ever accomplished. And we also just saw the Perseverance rover land on Mars. Thank you, Elon Musk. Stunning images. Well, of our was that Elon Musk? That now reality. No, I don't. I don't think Elon did that. I'm probably wrong on that. Go ahead and fact check me. I'm probably wrong on that. I know that there maybe they helped. I don't know. All right. I know that Elon's working on some big darn rocket, and he's also made me uh, uh, very happy with my Dogecoin investment so far. So that's pretty good. Let's get back to this. All right. I may be wrong on that. So go ahead and fact check me. Another example of the extraordinary American ingenuity, commitment, and belief in science and one another. See, he keeps relating Today, himself with science. I signed in the law the American Rescue Plan. Even though most of the stuff he talks about with COVID and everything else aren't uh, related to science, even though the American Rescue Plan, the COVID bill under the guise of a COVID bill, uh, bill funds abortion in other countries and all kinds of other crazy stuff, right? It only gives 9% to benefit the American people. It destroys jobs. Everything he's about to tell you is a lie. An historic piece of legislation that delivers immediate relief to millions of people. Includes $1,400 in direct rescue checks. 
payments. That means a typical family of four earning about $110,000 will so get much checks for $5,600 really deposited if they have direct deposit or in a check. A Look at his weird finger. It extends unemployment benefits. It helps small businesses. Dude, your arthritis is showing. Put it away. Many. It provides food and nutrition, keeps families in their homes. And it will cut child poverty in this country in People have been needing help that really experts. needed help for months now, you and jack. Fly, and it funds all the steps I've just described to beat the virus and create millions Look, he's of fading. jobs. he's fading. He looks so tired. In the coming weeks and months. How are you going to create millions of jobs? along with the first lady, the vice president, the second gentleman. See, they're going to sell this cabinet, to you guys. To speak directly to you. To tell he's going to travel to different cities about how to the tell American you this. rescue plan meets the moment. He's going to try the Trump rally. Case, I will acknowledge the seven people failed, that go. But it will not. He said, and if my plan fails, I will acknowledge it fails, but it will not. All right. Trump would come out brashly and say, my stuff won't fail. And his stuff didn't fail. Right. But he's coming out and saying the exact same thing. Right. But in a different way, psychologically. All right. If it fails, I will acknowledge it. I'm, I'm humble enough to do that, but it's not going to fail. See what I mean? Come on. Poop sandwich. About how after long, dark years. Dark again. One ding, ding, ding. Year, I should take a shot every time he says that. There is hope and light of better days ahead. Light. Uh, if we all do our part. Are we going to get in a room and start listening to Creed? Will be vaccinated soon. Our economy will be on the mend. Put my unicorn back. Our kids will be back in school. They should be we'll back already. Look at their suicide once rates. again that this country can do anything, hard things. Big things, important things. Ooh. Over a year ago. It was weird how you said that. No one could have imagined what we were about to go through. But now. Are you sure you didn't know about it? You have friends over there in the uh, experience Wuhan area, I heard. Binds us together Maybe you should ask your son. We are bound together by the loss and the pain of the days that have gone by. He's trying to 9-11 this. We're also us. bound together by the hope and the possibilities of the days in front of us. Yeah, tell the left to cool down their freaking crap. Tell the socialists to shut their mouth, put it all so away, and hold big tech through. accountable. We'll talk after Come that. Together. We'll talk after that. Kill the censorship and the cancel culture, Biden nation. boy, and we'll one talk America. after that. I believe we can, and we will. We're seizing this moment. Yeah, you are seizing this moment, Dems. We faced and overcame one of the toughest yep. and darkest periods. History in will record history. it that way if you win. The darkest we've ever known. Because you're riding on Trump's you. coattails, just like everyone else. We'll come out stronger, with a renewed faith in ourselves, a renewed commitment to one another, to our communities and to our country. This is the United States of America. Yeah. And there's nothing. Are you reminding yourself? Nothing. From the bottom of my heart, I believe this. There's nothing we can't do. We do it together. So can we go back to doing like so the right stuff all. like Trump was doing? And please, God, give solace to all those people who lost someone. Oh, Antifa is going to attack and now God because he mentioned God. Thank you for taking the time to listen. I look forward to seeing you. Ah, the 12,000 people that listened to him. Look, they're asking him questions. Peace out. Peace. You know how many people listen to that? 15,000 to, oh, it said 12,000 a little bit ago. Now, all of a sudden, 15,282. That was his big speech. Only 15,282 people listened to that and watched it on YouTube. Nobody cares about you, Biden. You're full of crap. We all think you're full of crap. Look, what's what do all these chats say? Are there uh, chat messages on the side here? How do I even, let's see, top chat replay. I can't make that work. It's not working anymore. Anyway, I was going to say, I guess they shut the chat. I guess you can't chat. I don't know. Look, guys, I'm sweating to death in this unicorn costume, okay? I didn't actually murder a unicorn. I'm not actually wearing its skin, nor do I identify as a, a, the magical and mythical uh, uh, Republicorn. Though, if you want to see more of the Republicorn and you want me to build up on the Republicorn ca uh, character, you should let me know in the comments below or email me, James 
lane at American Revely.com. Don't even try to steal Republic corn, folks. It'll be copyrighted within two weeks. All right, folks, do me a favor. Like I said, follow me on Gab, American underscore Revely. Follow me on Parlor American, un, uh, uh, bleh, not American underscore Revely, at the James Lane. I'm American underscore Revely uh, on Gab TV and also on Rumble. And also an Odyssey, O D Y S E E. Follow me everywhere. Please, please, please do me that favor. I need you to share. I need you to subscribe. I need you to hit notification bells. I need you to talk about the American Revely podcast. All right. This was just a fun thing I wanted to do. I wanted to try it out. I wanted to see if I could make you guys laugh a little bit. Some of it I kind of forced out. So even though I thought it was funny, it probably wasn't. But some of it was natural and I thought it came out pretty good. I, 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 uh, I, found myself laughing inside while I was doing it without actually trying. So I think you'll find some of this pretty entertaining and enlightening. And uh, it'll also just reveal just how full of crap Biden is. All right. It's a much better way to watch it. At least we're watching it together, you and I. And we're not, uh, you know, watching just Biden alone in the dark at 3 a.m. That's that's kind of like that's like watching the ring. You know, that's just terrifying. That's like the grudge at 2 a.m. by yourself watching a Biden speech. All of a sudden, he's like, ah, and you're like, ah, and just no bueno, not a good combination. All right, folks. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Talk some crap in the comments below. Share, share, share. I'm shadow banned to hell everywhere. So if you're wondering why I have a low count, if you want to help me fix that, then personally share this with people. Help me out, guys. I need you. I need you, American people. Street team gear coming soon. I have a wax stamp of a Kraken coming from Russia. All right, that I'm going to personally seal and stamp special envelopes with that I'm going to be sending out. So if you want to be a part of that, you better keep listening, spread the word, and stay tuned for more information, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, thank you, thank you. www.americanrevely.com. Okay, you can go there, hit the support us tab, donate, donate, donate. We need your help. It goes right back into the company so we can expand our operation. And I thank you for that from the bottom of my heart. Feedback, any questions, if you'd like to help us out, if you have special technical skills, audio, visual, uh, WordPress, uh, uh, digital art, all kinds of stuff. Email me. I need your help. James Lane at American And with that, I will see you in the next video. Thank you guys. Bye.